Hello everybody and hope you enjoyed those little replays. So yeah, Antronoids. This is a thing I did. I like the build though, most of the time it was Dogmatica that did most of the play, along with the Lair of Darkness, so the Antronoids didn't really get to shine too much, but the intent is there, I guess. So yeah, the Infernoid lineup is what it is. I don't have too much knowledge about Infernoids altogether. Uh, beside the fact that Decatron is the only normal summon and you need it. The Treasoning is a must, as well as one for one. I also played the Lord of Darkness package with Arima, of course Lord of Darkness and Terraforming. Monster Gate is also a Infernoid card of sorts, but it also helps with Lair of Darkness, due to the fact that it can tribute a monster on the opponent's side of the field. We've been playing the Dogmatica just to have something extra, so we can do shit. Nothing interesting over here, except maybe this. The Rank of Magic the 7th one. I haven't played this in a while, but I think it's a pretty decent tech in a Dogmatica deck. Mostly due to the fact that Rebarian Shark exists, can, you can send it with Maximus or with Punishment and get the rank of Magic the 7th one on the top of your deck, allowing you to exceed Summon Masquerade or any other uh, C100 and more number monster. Which are all very interesting to say the least. We're also playing Overload Fusion, so we can make Cyber Dark and a Dragon. I don't see people playing that in Dogmatica builds. They're mostly focused on the control aspect with NTSS, Titan Clad, and Pegasus, which I don't blame them. But still, you can cheese this out really easily with Maximus, since you can just send Cyber Dark Dragon and Cyber End Dragon. As well as you can use Predplan Camera Raffleseer to just get this out. Also, fun fact I uh, recently discovered, Cyber Dark and Dragon can equip cards like NTSS, Titan Clad, Camera Raffleseer, etc. to itself. Which is, which is pretty decent. However, if you're able to send those cards equipped to Cyber Dark and Dragon to the graveyard, they get their effects. So... Well, let's say that you make a Cyber Darken Dragon. You equip it with Elder Entity NTSS from your graveyard. Then you summon something like, mm, let's say, Magician Soul, and said, and you send this NTSS to the graveyard. You get to the draw, thanks to Magician Soul, and you get a pop, thanks to NTSS. Cyber Darken Dragon won't attack, but it's still an unbeatable beast or a monster. Nothing else I have to say about this deck. Never actually summoned Tierra, which is weird. And that will be it for today. I'll see everyone in the next one. Chicolos hanging out. Peace!